Hi guys, it's Joe. So this is a layout that I made for the I Am Roses sketch challenge for the month of November and I'll put the link to that challenge in the description box below. So this is the layout I made and as you can see, if you don't know already, that's myself and that's Rena. and this was taken at a crop at my new place and um, so I wanted to scrap a picture of us and these, this is the color, these are the colors I went with. I went with gray, um, a nice uh, mustard yellow. It's a little bright on the camera, but it's more of a mustard yellow. And um, these browns and uh, warm orange tones. So um, this is what I came up with. In regards to sketches, I, I kind of like just stick to the original... Um, layout of the sketch. I don't really go out of my way to alter the sketch. I pretty much follow it. Not to the exact T, but, but pretty much really close. So um, this is my layout and um, I do go over the products that I use at the end of the video and how um, I made it from start to finish. And here you can see I embossed some doily border, some beautiful trim from Sharon, some stickers that say friend, and then these are the I Am Roses flowers. And then I use a crocheted um, spray here. These die cuts are just miscellaneous die cuts that I have. I'm thinking they're from the Butterfly Garden from Pink Paisley, but I'm not sure. It's just stuff I had lying around. Here's a doily that I sprayed with Lindy Stamp Gang, some alpha stickers from Making Memories. I uh, just matted the picture with this um, orange color. I used some vellum paper to cut out my leaves. And then all these here are from I Am Roses. And then I just put um, a brad in the center. So here is my layout, really simple. And I hope you guys join us for the November sketch challenge and you get um, you can get a chance to win some beautiful I Am Roses flowers. And so now I'll just show you how I did this layout. Thanks for watching guys. Bye. Hi guys. So before I start on my layout, I wanted to show you all the supplies or pro um, items that I'm going to be using for the layout. And um, I'm going to start with the I Am Roses flowers, and this is the crochet spray. Um, it has the crochet flowers with the pearl centers. This one I already um, cut it up, so it's actually, here's the top part, and it's this long. So it's like that. So the crochet spray, I have all the items, and if I can link it to the items that are in stock, I'll put it in the description bar below. So I'm using the crochet spray right there. I'm using these um, daisies, and these are the new fall colors. And um, I'm going to be using the white one out of the pack. So I have those. I'm using these really mini roses as an accent and they're this they're really small so I'm using those um, I'm using the crochet flowers I'm using the uh, the tan one right there and then I'm using two different sizes of this color these are an R2 and an R3 look like that it's about a quarter inch and this is a half inch and let's see and that's it that's all the flowers that I'll be using on my layout and then for the supplies I'm going to be using um, a Versamark stamp pad the die I'll be using is the Sizzix die and this is branch let's see if it focuses uh, no, so um, it's the branch with leaves, but I'll have um, the name in the bottom. Some white embossing powder. Uh, let's see what else. I'm using these old thicker stickers that I have, and this was like a while back at when you could get them at uh, Big Lots. 
And here's the item number. It's not focusing. But it's these yellow stickers right there. I'm use, also using these dollar stickers from Making Memories. I have this stamp set from Maya Road. It's this doily border. Really pretty. One of my favorites. And it's the doily's border stamp. Uh, this is an old one. I'm using all the supplies that I already have on hand. So I didn't even get anything new here. So I like it because I'm using all my stuff. So these are these vintage accents. And it's from Creative Charms. And this one, does it have a color? It just has an item number, and I'll put that in the bottom. But it's these little, really pretty mustard looking brads. I'm using a white doily that I'm going to be spraying with my Lindy Stamp Gang Flat Fabios in Tears on My Pillow Tangerine and um, Sandra D. Sepia. And then um, this is an old uh, flower rack from Bridget and she's Shoe Princess One but I'm using her Tim Holtz Rosette flowers. Um, one of them, I already pulled it out. It's this one right here. Yay! Thanks Bridget! And this was a while back too so I'm using that. And then I just got this from Sharon, this beautiful um, trim with the pearls. So those are all the items that I'm using on my layout and the only paper I'm using um, is this gray 12 by 12 and I think this is from the black current die cuts with the view uh, paper stack and I love the gray color so this is what I'm using and that's it so let's get to my layout.